Recently, the Cadillac Lyric production model was revealed, and it's similar in specs and price to the Tesla Model Y. In this video, I'll perform a side-by-side -side comparison of the exterior, interior, tech, performance and pricing of these two EVs, and show you why the Cadillac and Tesla are complete opposites. The Lyric is the first EV for Cadillac, and thus an important model because it sets the direction for the rest of the range. It's styled as a crossover to target the segment that is so popular with drivers. Tesla wanted to target the crossover segment too, and its offerings are the Model X and the Model Y. The Model Y is a closer comparison to the Lyric based on specs and price, so that's what we'll focus on in this video. A quick production note. As Tesla has not provided video footage of the Model Y, in some shots I'll be using video footage of the similar Model 3. The design of the Model Y is minimalist and has been shaped by aerodynamics. The fastback profile, the sharply raked hood, and the spoiler are all designed to improve airflow and results in an impressive drag coefficient of 0.23. The result of this design effort is a jelly bean-like look with a smooth slippery skin that is devoid of any detailing or ornamentation. The skin of the Lyric is designed to be aerodynamic too, but Cadillac doesn't shy away from detailing and ornamentation. In fact, it takes a complete opposite approach of Tesla and revels in style and ornamentation. That starts with the design of the front. Some manufacturers have taken what used to be a grill in combustion cars and replaced it with either a body colored panel or a black panel. Cadillac takes the black panel concept to the extreme and extends it across the entire front, pushing the lights to the edges. The crystal black grille comes with integrated lighting that's choreographed with the vertical headlights, which are made to look like jewels. The rear also has the characteristic Cadillac L lights with a choreographed sequence. When it comes to dimensions, it's important to note that the Cadillac is almost 10 inches longer than the Model Y and has a wheelbase that is 8 inches longer. That puts it just a couple of inches shorter than the Model X or, to put it in another context, it is sized between a Cadillac XT5 and XT6. So this is a big car. And I suspect that much of that length is captured in the front axle to dash ratio. With that long hood, Cadillac was looking to give the Lyric luxury premium proportions. And as a result of that long hood and imposing front, the Lyric has the same regal presence as a classic Cadillac and brings those characteristic Cadillac qualities into the EV era. But will those longer exterior dimensions of the Lyric translate into more legroom on the inside? Well, not quite. Surprisingly enough, it's the Model Y that has the larger legroom and headroom dimensions. And that is a testament to Tesla's dedication to efficiency that they have managed to squeeze out more interior room from a smaller exterior package speaks to their efficient engineering and design abilities. And then Tesla also managed to squeeze in a third row, albeit a tight one. When it comes to cargo room, Tesla has provided only one number, and there too it exceeds the Lyric's cargo room by about 10%. The Model Y's interior is much like the other Tesla models, clean and super minimalist. There is no instrument cluster, all the functions are consolidated into a horizontally mounted 15 inch touchscreen. The seats are available in two colors and trim accents include wood. The full glass roof opens up the interior, making it feel spacious. The Lyric's interior is clean too, but with the complete opposite approach compared to the Model Y, it is full of luxury touches. One of the highlights is this delicate backlit laser etched pattern that is cut through open pore wood. The triangular shapes recall the triangular shape of the light cluster. In keeping with the luxury feel, numerous touch points have a knurled metal finish and the center console appears to cantilever out and float. Ambient lighting and a textured metal trim add a high-end feel to the interior. The instrument cluster and infotainment screen are combined into this 33-inch, high-resolution, gently-curved touchscreen. Like the Tesla, 
catalog offers the interior only in two colors. When it comes to tech, there's a healthy competition between these two. A big feature for both are their driver assist systems. Tesla already has autopilot and you've probably seen some pretty impressive videos of the future self-driving capability which promises to auto steer on city streets. When you buy the full self-driving package, it also comes with a number of features including lane change capability, self-parking and summon. GM also has assistive driver technologies, but the real highlight is the available Super Cruise. Super Cruise is available on certain compatible roads and uses cameras, sensors and LiDAR map data to keep distance and center the vehicle in lane. The system is robust enough that it allows you to take your hands off the wheel, something that Tesla's system doesn't allow you to do. Of course, you have to keep your eyes on the road and the car has sensors to make sure you are doing so. The system can also execute lane changes. In addition to the impressive Super Cruise, Cadillac also offers an augmented head-up display and remote self-parking. So that brings us to performance. The Lyric rides on the all-new Altium platform and comes with a 100 kilowatt hour battery. At launch, it will only come in rear-wheel drive. A performance all-wheel drive is planned for the future. The Model Y has a 75 kilowatt hour battery and comes only in all-wheel drive, in either a long-range variant or a performance variant. When it comes to range, the Lyric expects to deliver 300 miles, whereas the long-range Tesla delivers 326 miles and the performance 303 miles. Keep in mind a couple of things. The first is that the Lyric's number is GM's estimate and not an EPA estimate. And the second is that the Lyric is rear-wheel drive. To do an equal comparison, I would expect that an all-wheel drive version would get about 5 to 10% less. What these range numbers reveal is Tesla's impressive engineering and efficiency advantage, showing how they can squeeze more mileage from a smaller battery. The horsepower and torque numbers are pretty close, but keep in mind that the Lyric has only one motor, the Tesla 2. We don't have numbers for the Lyric all-wheel drive at this time, but given the already powerful rear-wheel drive, it will be interesting to see what they come up with for the all-wheel drive. We don't have 0 to 60 times for the Lyric either, but given that it is quite a bit heavier, I expect that it will be slower than the Model Y. Again, the lightweight is a testament to Tesla's efficiency. For charging, the max DC power for the Cadillac is 190 kilowatt, not too far from Tesla's 250 kilowatt at its superchargers. But while Tesla might beat Lyric on numbers, I think the real difference between these two will be in the way they drive. And I expect that those two experiences will be complete opposites. The Model Y suspension has double wishbones in the front and multi-link in the rear, leading to a stiffer, more performance-oriented drive. The Lyric is not available for test drives, but what we do know is that the suspension will come with passive plus dampers front and rear. Those should give the Lyric a more comfortable ride than the Model Y's ride. A ride that I expect will be more in line with the luxury Cadillac experience. No word on if the magnetic ride control will be available, hopefully on the all-wheel drive performance or V-series versions. When it comes to price, the Cadillac is priced more in line with the performance version of the Model Y. We don't know details of what the Lyric base model includes, but at first glance, it looks like the Model Y will be the value option in this comparison. The Model Y is available now in the States and the Lyric will be available in the first half of 2022. So, which one would you buy? The efficiency and performance oriented Tesla Model Y or the stylish, luxury oriented Cadillac Lyric? Let me know in the comments below. And if you would like me to compare the Lyric to another competitor, let me know the name of that car too. Please give the video a like, share your comments below and subscribe to the driver download.